Wall Street Memes Casino. I'm fine. And Sportsbook. This is Joe Pugh for IFL TV. I'd like to join her here at Newlands Gym. New British Boxing Board of Control professional licence holder as of yesterday to me. Uh, that must feel good to hear that, mate. Yeah, very good, man. It's been a long time coming and we're finally here. Um, yeah, so all went well at the meeting yesterday and all goes well and then we'll get your uh, pro debut very soon, mate. Yeah, no, literally... Um it was a good interview, to be honest. Was, um, one of them was actually a, a judge, a, a lot of my amateur fights, so it was good to see him there. Um, but yeah, it was good. We just had a conversation, really. And um, yeah, I thought I knew it passed, so good to go now. Yeah, obviously down here at Newlands, I know you was kind of seeing a few gyms, uh, seeing the best options for you turning over as a professional. But I saw you down here a few weeks ago, and I kind of see... The sparkle in your eye when it comes to this gym and Kevin Lilly, so pleased that you two have kind of properly teamed up now. Yeah, yeah, I'm pleased, man, over the moon. Um, well, it's exactly yeah, it's still on probation. <laughs> still on probation, but I, 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 think, I think you're well liked in the Kevin Lilly camp, mate. Yeah, man, uh, it's a good vibe, good buzz down there. Um, me and Kev obviously get on like a house on fire, and that's what you need in the early stages going forward. Um, so yeah, I'm buzzing to be obviously around Nina, world champion. I can't ask for any more, to be honest. Yeah, look, we've seen the videos of your amateur bouts and the power you possess. But in the short time you've been here, do you feel like you are learning, making those slight adaptions you will need to become a, a successful professional? Yeah, for sure. Um, Kevin's obviously showing me the little tricks and stuff. I've had some good sparring uh, recently with Billy Allenton. Um, he's been showing me a little bit of the moves and stuff. I'm getting to grips with that. Um, but to be honest, a lot of it I, I actually had. It's just Kevin's bringing it back out of me. Um, I couldn't get away with it in the amateurs, obviously. But um, this game is way more suited to me, so I'm able to, to bring it out now and show it. Yeah, we see with your management stable... Uh, kind of debuts starting to be made. Romeo Costa, I think, was last week. So now, starting to get a little bit itchy knuckles now. You want to get involved in the action? Yeah, for sure. I mean, obviously, now that I've got the licence, yeah. it's only a matter of time now, do you know what I mean? Just got to do my medicals and stuff, and then we're good to go. Get the ball rolling. Speaking to your manager and trainer, um, although you do want to get the ball rolling straight away. It's not a rush with you, is it? You can take it as fast, as slowly as you want. You've got the time on your hands and you've got so much potential, it'd be a shame to rush it all. Yeah, for sure. Um, this game's about taking your time, being patient, you know. You see a lot of these uh, kids and prospects taking too big a jump early and, you know, once you're up there, there's no going back down. So um, I want to take my time make sure I've got the experience down my belt, uh, rounds and whatnot, so that there's no questions when it's title uh, opportunity time. Still looking to turn over at lightweight? <laughs> uh, we'll see, we'll see. Um, to be honest, I, I, reckon, I reckon I'll be campaigning at 140, yeah. um, super lightweight. I think that makes sense, comfortable. I won't lose any of my attributes, and that's the main thing, you know. There's no point boiling yourself down to a weight and you're not the same fighter anymore, but I can punch, so be fine at 140 for sure. Yeah, you look at those 140 pounders, I know you're a long way off in the experience levels right now, but domestically so stacked when you look all the way from kind of you, Banks, your Azeem, your Dalton Smith, but good kind of measuring sticks to aspire to be like in what, two, three, four years time? Yes, uh, definitely. I mean, I spied a couple of those uh, names, obviously Adam, um, Azeem, that was great sparring, appreciative of him for giving me the opportunity for them rounds. Uh, Luke McCormack as well, obviously he just turned pro recently, had his debut. Um, so it's a good gauge for me, um, size-wise as well, and obviously just to see where I'm at and where I can go, you know. So, yeah, um, definitely looking at those boys and, you know, seeing where I can go. Power still going to play a big part in your pro career moving forward. Yeah, for sure. Um, listen, don't get me wrong. I know I've banged on a lot about my power and stuff uh, in my pro promotional videos and stuff, but I've got way more than just power. Like, <laughs> if you've been in the ring with me, you you know that as well. I can be flurry when I need to be, but see, the amateurs is all I've had to show. And you've got three rounds to get work done. You can't really take your time and show your whole skill set. So the pros, the longer rounds, you'll get to see everything that I've got to bring. 
obviously, I've been around you a little bit now and something that I've picked up, speaking to a few people you've trained with and as well as Leon. Work ethic's a big thing for you, isn't it? And you won't let kind of laziness pass you by and that, that won't stop you, will it? No, definitely. Um, definitely not, should I say. Um, I started at 18. You know, I can't afford to be slacking or having times off and going holidays and all this. I know they say, oh, you should have a balanced life and all this, but listen, nobody that achieved greatness ever had a balanced life coming forward. And with me starting late, I need to make sure I do everything 100% and meticulous. So, yeah, nah, hard work for sure. Excellent, to me. I think we've covered everything. I will hopefully uh, speak to you when we get some news about your pro debut. Hopefully won't be waiting too much longer. But anything else you'd like to mention before we finish? Um, just stay tuned. Uh, thank you for everyone that's supporting me currently. Um, and yeah, stay tuned for some debut. Wall Street Memes Casino. I'm fine. And Sportsbook.